what are you doing under there? That's all right. We're about to jack up the MR2 to uh, put the wheel spacers on. Why don't you come on out and help? Hello everyone, my name is Brendan and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be putting the wheel spacers and the emergency brake boot that I got for Christmas on my MR2. So let's get right into it. So I'm going to be installing these six millimeter spacers in the rear of my MR2 just to help with this wheel gap here in the back fenders. Shout out to Brittany for these. You're the best. Safety first. All right, now before I get the car jacked up, I just need to break these lugs really quick. So let's go and do that. So as you can see, I've got this hub centric ring here and that just is on there because the wheels that I got are not hub centric. And the wheel spacer here has a tapered side and a flat side. The tapered side goes onto the hub and then the ring can sit right on the outside of that afterwards. So as you can see, these small oval holes just fit right around the studs there. And then the wheel just slides right back on over the top of it. So as you can see, I stuck the ring back on the inside of the wheel because it actually didn't go on the wheel spacer over the top. So I'm just gonna keep the ring in here and reseat the uh, wheel back on the studs. So I've just got the lug nuts hand tight and now I'm gonna lower it down and torque them. So I'm gonna torque these down to 100 foot pounds and when you're torquing lug nuts down, you always want to go in a star pattern. And that just makes sure that it gets torqued on there evenly. So I'm going to go ahead and do that now. So after you do all of that on this side, you're going to do it on the other side. Uh, but I've already finished that, so let's get on to the emergency brake boot. All right, so this boot is supposedly just a slip-on. So it's supposed to come down here, and then I guess you're supposed to tuck this extra stuff down the sides. So I had my wife get the e-brake boot in because I couldn't. And it looks pretty good. So I wanted to thank everyone for 69 subscribers on YouTube. Never thought I'd make it to that milestone. But anyways, thanks for watching.